My beautiful Leos, welcome to your Leo plus Leo love reading for the month of August. Happy birthday to my Leo sons out there. Wishing you a blessed, abundant birthday season with many, many years to come. This is your love reading for my Leos who are connecting to a fellow Leo or somebody who also has Leo in their chart. I have you as the watcher, Leo, on this side. That's my intention. But for some of you, the reading can resonate backwards, reverse, flipped. Assign the roles as you wish. Take what messages are yours and leave the rest behind. We are looking into feelings, actions, outcome, and oracle for August. So please show me what are this Leo's feelings for my Leo's and my Leo's feelings for them. Y'all are mine. Just in case you're wondering. All right, Leo. So their feelings for you are the Two of Swords, the Star, and the Hanged Man. Your feelings for them are the Sun, the World, and the Ace of Swords. Okay, let's start with you, Leo. You look like you have a lot of clarity. You look like you're clear, you are concise, you are understanding and knowing what you want from this Leo, whether it's to be with them or not be with them. You know what you want. You know what you're looking for in love. You are very clear on it. You know what your happiness looks like and you're striving to have that in whatever way, shape or form. This Leo's feelings for you, uh, I feel like this Leo is closed off emotionally. They are feeling very stuck towards you. So they can feel stuck on you or stuck in terms of a decision-making process towards you. So it's going to be different for all of you. But with the star here, this person is really hoping that they can heal or have some sort of healing energy with you. But uh, I definitely feel an indecision or a stuck-like feeling. They definitely seem stuck. Either they're not making any moves or they're uncertain on what moves to make. You know, this person could just be stuck on you specifically. Let's see the actions towards each other. Show me this Leo's actions towards my Leo's and my Leo's actions towards them. All right, so this Leo's actions towards you are the Ace of Cups, the King of Swords, and the Star again. Definitely, um, there could be something about Aquarius season between the two of you. I don't know. This person loves you. They definitely have love for you. Um, do they have a good way of showing it? No. Are they going to try to show it? Sort of. So I see a love offer coming your way from this Leo. But they have a funny way of being emotional. I feel like they are very detached on the surface. Very hard to read. But this person is definitely interested in having a cycle with you in terms of love or renewed sense of love your actions are strength the chariot and the six of wands all right so leo you are definitely fully focused on i will give to situations that make me feel good i will give to situations that make me feel happy and like I'm moving forward. Some of you, it definitely is going to feel good to get this Leo um, offer, whether it's a new offer or a offer from a Leo you're already aware of. What's Leo's actions towards this other Leo? Six of Swords, Ace of Swords. 
So I definitely feel like for a lot of you, you are interested in moving forward with a new person, especially if this is a newer Leo coming into your life. Um, you know what you're looking for, and this definitely could present itself and give you that oomph and going towards love that you're looking for or waiting to find you in some sort of way. It's definitely finding you here. Um, others of you, there's just absolutely a new cycle here between you and a Leo. It looks like you two have been stuck for quite some time, but it does look like there is a very strong breakthrough between the two of you, whether this is a communication breakthrough or just a breakthrough for your love life in reaping reward of a new cycle and or new person. Um, you have very strong Leo energy here and Aquarius. So I don't know if this is in your charts or there's something about Aquarius season here. But there's definitely a breakthrough here between you and a Leo. I feel like for some of you as well, that there's been a lot of distance. There could be a breakthrough in seeing each other or moving this forward past the blockage. So let's see what the outcome is between the two of you. One sec. Show me the outcome between these two Leos for the month of August. Five of Pentacles. Knight of Swords. Strength. Four of Cups. So I definitely feel like for a lot of you, this could be a Leo that you had an ending and or abandonment with. Others of you, you've just been single for quite some time. And here comes this person. I feel like they're coming in, coming in pretty quickly here with the Knight of Swords. Either they're just not here and they're all of a sudden they're here. Or they were just missing in action for quite some time. Clarify the Four of Cups. There you go, the Fool. So there is a new beginning here available between you and a Leo. If you want it. I kind of feel like you both aren't showing much emotion towards each other. For whatever reason why. But you're very clear here, Leo. You know what you want. And if this individual doesn't show that they could give it to you or give it to you on their in their return, then you don't have any problem with moving on and seeing what else is out there. But this person's definitely making a decision or there's some sort of breakthrough between you and a Leo. So let's see what the Oracle has here in terms of zodiac signs in this spread that could also be in your charts. Like I said, very strong Leo. You have um, strong Aquarius here as well. Pisces, Cancer, and Aries. So your first Oracle is the third chakra, card number three. The energy of the solar plexus chakra helps us to realize who we are and who we want to be. Yeah, I do feel a very large sense of clarity and clear, concise energy. This is what I want. This is where I'm going. This is what's fueling me towards love. If you can give it to me, great. If you can't, I'm not going to let it bother me. And multidimensionality. Exactly. Card number 33 three up here. Some of you, that could be... Um, a numerology number you've been seeing or will start seeing. The frequency of multidimensionality activates our awareness of our true essence, which is eternal and multidimensional. Yeah, Leo, you're looking for a love with this energy that feels different, that feels rare, that feels unique. You're very clear on what you're looking for. This energy is going to try to give it to you. I feel like you are in a high decision-making process towards this. So, Thank you, my beautiful Leos, for being here and for watching. If you are looking for a different sign, check the channel. It may be out already. If it's not, ring the bell so you are alerted when the zodiac sign you're looking for's reading is released. And Leo, the Leo season giveaway is out. And we have over a thousand comments on that to enter to win. So definitely head over to the Leo season giveaway and comment, subscribe to make sure the comment generator filters you out, to make sure you are of a entry for the giveaway. And yeah, that's what I have. So Leo, I'll see and talk to all of y'all very, very soon. Have a good one and bye now.